Hey guys, Crystal and Shadow here, back with Steven Universe, and this time... We're starting season two. And the episode is full disclosure. I am so glad that the episode actually picks up with everything that happened last time. Yeah, it, it definitely, it literally picks up right where it left off. And you know what? Once again, I called it saying that the Connie call was going to come in handy. Yeah, definitely. It turned out it was a cliffhanger, not a brick joke, so hey, even better. Yeah. Yeah, I... Some people find it interesting how Steven's trying to protect people. Some people hate it. Yeah, I don't know. Like, I guess he doesn't really think about the consequences. He doesn't think how much it's hurting his friend by um, by lying to her. Not lying, but, like, um, trying to avoid her. Yeah, we've got another song in the episode. Yeah, I guess he he just believes that um, he's not important to her, I guess. I guess. I don't know. It was okay, but I don't know. No, I really enjoyed the episode. It's great that it continued, and it, you know, I'm glad they didn't just sweep everything under the rug, and it really does show everything that happened last see, last episode. Yeah, yeah. One thing I liked is um, when it shows the episode title, you see... Um, you know, usually it changes depending on, like, what time of day we're starting and stuff. And this time, we saw um, pieces of the green ship all over. Yeah. I like that, yeah, we've still got that to clean up. I liked that shot when Connie runs through the piece of ship, and it's like she's inside it, and she can sort of get a glimpse of what Stephen saw, I guess. I guess, but yeah, the highlight of the episode was the song, mainly because I like how they incorporated the um the, the ringtone. Ring yeah, I like yeah. I've always before now he's had that ringtone, and I liked it because that's a proper ringtone that you know. It's a like how a lot of yeah TV... it sounds like a default ringtone. And no, it is a default ringtone. I like how a lot of shows um a lot of shows will use like the generic Apple one, whereas this I can't remember what this one is from, but. The fact that they didn't not just used it but then incorporated it into the song was Yeah. <laughs> I like that. That was clever. I like that for a moment it looks like he's gonna throw his phone off the cliff. I know. But then Lars already did that, remember? You know what? I know I usually call him a stupid character, but I actually think Ronaldo's bit here, even though he's annoying, actually was kinda good. Yeah, yeah. I mean, he's really the one who gave Stephen the idea to kind of shelter everyone from what's going it on. It kind of, yeah, yeah, it almost makes you feel like you're watching certain other shows now with with Stephen wanting to keep secrets and live a secret life where he does yeah. stuff. Yeah. Luckily, even the gems have enough sense to tell him, no, you got to keep your human side and see your dad and friends. Yeah, I know. And I like the fact that the gems actually say we should try to clean up everything too. Yeah. Even though, because it reminds me of, um, it's like in the flat, not the flat, the, um, the Blackout episode where they just don't care. Because oh, in the Blackout yeah. episode, they're like, eh, it'll happen in a minute or a thousand years, who cares? <laughs> Whereas here they actually take some responsibility for everything. Well, they said, to, it's, the ship had to, gem tech, really advanced stuff, and... Well, that was know- Stephen who said that, though. No, Garnet said humans could really hurt themselves if they but got after, a hold of... The... No, it was Stephen. He was looking at the window. He's like, we should really clean up. We should, you know, they didn't... Oh, whatever. No, Garnet was the first one to say we should get started cleaning up. Yeah, but Stephen was the one who said about the gem tech. No, Garnet said something. I'm about... almost certain it was. Well, I will play the clip to prove who's right. <laughs> but And they reference a flashback episode because they said there used to be a fence there. Yeah, true. <laughs> Let's build a boat. I'll be the alligator. Yeah. But all in all, I'm glad it was a continuous episode. It's nice when an episode, you know, I was so worried that the start of the season would just kind of be, you know, a filler or just a clean slate, but it wasn't, and I'm glad. Yeah. I mean, they don't have the fence anymore, but things are still kind of hidden because, um... In Beach Party, one of the pizzas did say, I've never been to this side of the beach. Yeah, because you can see from the angle that it, it's not always clear, but when they're standing on a different cliff, you can see that the house is facing completely away from the rest of the town. Yeah, you'd have to, from the town, you'd, you'd have, have to, to kind actually of go around, around the cliff to see it, yeah. Mm. 
Yeah, I like that that angle we get when they stand up on that cliff. And I like that shot when Ronaldo's saying, you got to protect them from the stuff and it kind of pans over there. Yeah. But all in all, it was an enjoyable episode. It didn't... And, and yeah, it's an episode where we didn't have to worry about having action or anything crazy. Yeah, maybe it's just because I've seen it before. It's not one that I'd rewatch for it's fun. Not, that's the thing. It's not a fun episode. It's yeah, an episode that it's works... It's essential to the plot. It works well to continue from last time, but I understand, yeah, you wouldn't want to just put it on for the fun of it. You'd, do, you'd, you'd put Onion on for the fun of it. <laughs> yeah. But... I suppose that's it. I'm going to give it a nice eight. Wow. I'll just go... Yeah, it it does its thing. It's, I'll give it a seven. All right. With that being said, do you remember what the next episode is called? Joyride. Ah. Stephen and Connie are going to steal a car. Wait, they already stole a car, didn't they? What well, didn't steal a car. But it was that episode with um, Lars. Oh, yeah, yeah, well, he had to drive it because the others were... Okay, Stephen and Connie steal a car. No, 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 Onion would steal a car. You know he would. (laughs) We'll see. We'll see who is riding in what. Wait, Amethyst will, because she said she's used to hot wiring cars. We'll see. Next time, Amethyst steals a car. See you next time.